Hello and welcome back. This is Ashkul Rafi once again. In this video, I'm going to show you how I send proposals on Upwork job posts. So here I have got this job post on recreating existing WordPress pages into Elementor and we have been working on WordPress and Elementor. I have got a complete course which is completely free on my YouTube channel. And this job posted was about 24 minutes ago and the budget is 125. So I'm going to open this job post in a new tab and after that I'm going to show you some of the things that I notice that I follow before I go for applying on any new job. So as you can see here the very first thing that I verify is if the client has a payment method verified and regarding to this this client has a payment method verified and right after that I notice how many reviews this client have and then what is the status of the reviews for example here i have got five stars out of 10 reviews so the client is with a great reputation here on upwork then the client's other job information as you can see the hourly rate which um, usually this client is paying and the number of or the amount this client has already spent on upwork and here's the information about this client's country so he's from estonia he or she and now I'd love to read the job description right here. So here, hello, we are looking for someone to recreate existing WordPress page into Elementor page. So we are learning Elementor and we know about Elementor website editing, website web page creation. So this is the job which is perfectly going with our skills. Now, currently these pages are made with Tribe Architect and we want to make a switch to Elementor for all the pages. So. As of now, client has a web page, website which has Tribe Architect based page designs, page layouts and now we have to convert these pages or recreate these pages using Elementor. So this is a simple project. Now we have about 10 pages but basically only 3 designs since most of them use a similar concept. So though this client has about 10 pages but only three types of designs we have to work on so this is going to be one kind of copy and pasting stuffs uh, for this whole pages and after that if you have design improvement recommendations they are welcome but otherwise there is no need to redesign the page it is just a task for recreating existing pages so client is telling us like if we can make some improvement give some idea about improving the design as it is currently we have got on the client site we can simply give them the recommendation we can make the changes other than that it is totally fine to simply watch the design see the design on the existing web page and then make a new design on Elementor using Elementor on WordPress for the client so this is it for the job and then if the work is satisfactory we may in engage you for a larger project so again this is a great uh, message here if we can satisfy our client they might going to provide us large projects in future and then thank you so this is it and he's currently interviewing he or she is currently interviewing one but i'd love to send the proposal anyways and it's going to cost me four connects here okay so let me just click on submit a proposal and after that i'm going to uh, start applying so let me just take you a little bit down and after that i'm going to take the um, budget here budget information so i'd love to keep like by project and i'd love to keep this as it is so i'm going to receive 100 us dollars um, out of this 125 budget so 25 is the pork fee a pork service fee so let's see then we have to select this one how long will this project take obviously it is going to take like one to two days so let me just select less than one month we have got few more options but let's select this one and now it's time to write the cover letter so hi um i okay please check out my uh, Some of the works I have done about creating recreating websites using Elementor 
and then I'm going to add few of the examples which we are currently working on obviously if you are a complete beginner you will have these like let's say um, this portfolio so as I already have client projects so I'd love to add some from here so the first one that I'd love to add is chat third and I'm going to paste it here it would be my pleasure to um, recreate the 10 web pages you have got on Thrive as you can see here we have got Thrive Architect so I'm going to type out Thrive Architect which is pretty simple here Thrive Architect uh, web page you have got on Thrive Architect and I am available to dedicate full time to complete the project as as up so this is pretty simple hi please check out my recent project about recreating website using elementor it would be my pleasure to recreate the 10 page 10 web pages you have got on thrive architect and i'm available to dedicate full time okay 10 pages you have got on thrive architect to elementor and I am available to dedicate full time to complete the project as of. So this is the short message. Always whenever you are applying on a job, make sure you are providing any reference to your previous works. And then if you can like add some other projects, if you have got like you can upload some files, you can simply upload. And if you have got worked on local servers like this, let me just open this up. We have been working on this local server. Simply take a screenshot and I have got an, a video about how to take full screenshot. So simply take a full page screenshot and here we go. Simply save this file. Save it, let's say on downloads. And after that, come back here, upload. Let's select the file, upload this one. and this is the way how you can add your local server based uh, web page on Upwork job post which is going to help you out to get jobs okay so I'm uh, and then looking forward to uh, have uh, working with you start working with you okay this is the simple job proposal the way I mostly follow and I get responses <laughs> right so now it's time to type out like actually it's pretty simple now just if you have got live works you can simply add your live works links and if you don't have a live work you can add the screenshots like this by as you can see i have got this one on localhost and i have just taken the screenshot of this page which is here and i have got this uh, tutorial about how to create or take a full page screenshot in one of my videos i'm to attach the video link for sure for you okay guys so this is the process simple now it's time to click on this submit a proposal button and after that i have to click on this yes i understand and then let me click on continue to submit and here we go we have got a, a proposal sent to this job post just take a look how my cover letter is looking like here now client will be able to simply click here download the file and view, view my works if the client is interested from uh, directly from the proposal right so this was the process of applying on a elementary based project on upwork and i believe you have found this video helpful if you did please let me know by commenting below please give this video a like and if you are interested to learn more about upwork learn more about uh, elementor wordpress web design services etc please don't hesitate don't forget to subscribe to my channel i'm going to upload more relevant videos for sure thank you so much for watching have a good day and i hope to see your success bye bye